Ellen Sandal. I'm the General Manager of the Australian Youth Climate Coalition. I submitted a question on OurSay.org and my question is, it's widely acknowledged that the most efficient and effective way to deal with climate change is by putting a price tag on pollution. It makes polluters accountable and also rewards businesses who do the right thing and clean up their act. The Labor Party has shelved the introduction of a price indefinitely. The Coalition has ruled out the idea of a price entirely. They want to make taxpayers pay polluters to stop their emissions rather than actually making polluters accountable. Why are both major parties ruling out the most cost-effective way of dealing with climate change? Well, the Labor Party, of course, wants to put a price on carbon and Julia Gillard has said that that is her preference and it's mine too. If you remember, we went to the last election with both major parties agreeing to an emissions trading scheme. The Labor Party did the hard work of getting unions, business, the community and the environment lobby all to agree to an emissions trading scheme. It wasn't perfect, but it was the start. Unfortunately, the Liberal Party walked away from it and the Greens political party voted it down. We now have to do the work to build that support again and we have to get an emissions trading scheme that will be there for the long term. If we're asking people to invest billions of dollars in building new sources of energy, they have to know that the scheme that we have in place will be there regardless of who's in government, that it will last for the long term. The Greens are the only party going to this election with a proposal to put a price tag on pollution. We believe that the polluters should be made to pay. That will drive down pollution and we can use the proceeds raised from a carbon tax and ultimately an emissions trading scheme to start compensating any householders who are affected by any potential rising energy prices. And I must say too that the Greens policy is for uh, introducing energy efficiency into homes which is actually going to see people's power bills cut. Um, but we believe that polluters should pay and that can compensate households rather than the other way around. Uh, Labor and Liberal got together and put up a policy towards the end of last year um, that would have seen Australia's pollution increase and our greenhouse gas emissions increase. We need a price on carbon, we need it right across the economy, we need a robust tax followed by an emissions trading scheme that is going to drive Australia's response to climate change and transition us quickly to a clean energy economy.